to punish Daniel. And when I turned her down, she was angry. Carla didn't like rejection. After that, she, she refused to stay with me. So you phoned Mr. French? Immediately, yeah. But he said he was busy and he couldn't get out straight away. But he didn't arrive too late to see her. He made me take him straight to where she was. I took him to the town square where she was with her friend, uh, Helen, and two guys. Daniel was very angry. I tried to calm him down. Uh, Carla was a wild girl, but she adored him. He wouldn't listen. I left him there drinking and went home. Was that the last time you saw Mrs. French? Yes. And Daniel French? I'd set up late waiting for him. Eventually, I, I just went to bed. Mr. Waveney, Daniel French told the court he had decided to have an early night. He's lying. He didn't come back to my house until well after dawn. Hello. There isn't a shred of proof. It was you, wasn't it? Helen? How did you do that, Daniel? How did you do that? Why something do you believe like Paul? That? You don't know it! scare you. I, I just thought you might need a chat. It's okay. Look, I, I can go. I can come back. No. No. No, please. It must have been a terrible shock. I'm sorry I could, couldn't tell you what I knew. I can't believe I've been so foolish. I believed everything you told me. Man, Helen. He, right from the start, he knew that it wasn't me, but he kept on torturing me. What are you talking about? I thought that I'd killed Carla. Why? We had a fight, a terrible fight on the path where she was found, and Daniel must have seen so us. He was waiting for her. I fell and um, I passed out. And when I came to, Carla was lying next to me and um, she was dead. And I had a rock in my hand. You see, Paul, he was trying to frame me because he put the rock in the wrong hand. Because I'm left-handed and he didn't know. Put it down, Helen. Is there a back way out? Um, yes. I don't understand. Why didn't you say anything in Greek? I went home straight away. Everyone said it was an accident. Get in. But you must have suspected something. I didn't know what to think. Oh, my God. It's Dina. Were you covering for him? No, no, I, I didn't even know about the inquest. I was in shock after Carla died. I, I just lost a very close friend. Why was she avoiding you? On the island, she was avoiding you. She couldn't face me. She was angry. She'd come out all that way, and I turned her down. No, 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 she was frightened of you. 
Don't she told you? Trust Carla to turn it into a drama. What are you doing? He was following us. Now, where are we going? We're going to talk, then we go to the police. Shit! Oh, will you slow down? We've got to get our story straight. What story? She was embarrassed. You know what she was like? Carla wanted me out of her life. She wasn't scared, OK? She wasn't scared. You've got to be clear about that. Why? Because Daniel will try and get to you again. Leave it. Leave it. It's him. Switch it off. Switch it off! Carla knew how much I cared about her. I knew that she was going through a really, a really bad time. I met her at the airport. I, I bought her flowers. I, I cooked her dinner. I listened to her pour her heart out. Then what happened? She got drunk. My, my villa's right by the sea. I, I marched her down the beach to try and sober her up. She kept on, she kept on kissing me, saying how much she loved me. And I, I, I had to tell her. I had to tell her that, that no. Right, stop the car. Don't be stupid. No, I know this story. Stop the car. I heard it on the island. Carla told me. She said that it happened a long time ago, but it didn't, did it, Paul? What are you talking about? It happened about? the night that she arrived. She came to you for help. She trusted you, and you raped her. I, I loved her. I always loved her. I was always there for her. But she didn't care. She was just, she was just using me. You had to shut her up before she told Daniel. No, no, no. no. You knew where the villa was. You couldn't trust her not to tell anyone. So you waited on the track and you killed her. And then you tried to frame me. You made those phone calls. No, and when no. And didn't work, you turned on Daniel. He's taking you in as well, isn't he? Just like Carl. Stop the car. I cannot get enough of it. <laughs> That's why she was frightened of him. That's why she wouldn't stay with him. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. She tried to tell me and I wouldn't listen. Carla was hard to help. That last night in the square, she said that she had something important to tell me and I thought that she was just pretending. You never knew with Carla. He raped her and I didn't listen to her. I didn't believe her either. It's all right. It's all right. When did she tell you? Oh, my God. It was you. You were out on the track. You saw us fight. Helen. She told you that she'd been raped. She left me. She'd thrown herself a paw. He lied. I believed him. She betrayed me twice. She was always lying. I thought she'd say anything to make me forgive her. And I just stabbed. But I didn't mean to kill her. It was an accident. You're the only person who could possibly understand. I love you. We have each other now. We're the same. You and me, we're the same.
Lloyd Carter with another drama premiere starting soon. Neve Cusack and Peter Davison star in Too Good To Be True, and that's next Monday evening at 9. Back to tonight, the ITV News is next.